I think it's going good. I think it is. All right, amazing. Stream works. That's that's good. That's very good. Now, let's go over to Rain World. This is my save file. This is not my save file. I'm going to switch back to save slot one. There we go. Yeah, uh, the it it really is a shame that I didn't have or couldn't stream with my mic on for the last few streams, but hey, whatever. But yeah, this place really is interesting. I I really like the idea that you get to explore the city, and also I like the fact that. You can now explore some different parts of iterators, which wasn't a thing before, like you saw in the previous stream. I did get into some form of an iterator, it might still be five pebbles, I mean it's probably five pebbles, I am in his city. Uh, Pebbles is an absolutely ginormous superstructure. These guys have to sit here. It's. I really hate fighting scavengers. They're like that. I guess that guy just fell down and promptly exploded. Oh, that's an iterator, right? That's or not an iterator, that's from the overseer. Can I get up? Thank you. I thought that was from like an egg bug. yourself through that hole because it is only one tile. Right, nice. Nice. The scavengers are going away. That's excellent. That is absolutely excellent. I prefer to fight scavengers on more even terrain with like only a few bumps or when there is a horizontal pipe because horizontal pipes really easy to deal with you just kind of kite them make them get into the pipe at which point you can kind of just pop out and stab them that guy is probably dead no use of stabbing him I know that's probably no significant harassment or seven red suns that you're showing me, but not right now, man. I'm busy. Trying not to get inked off by a fucking vulture. Don't you dare. I wish the, ver the vertical screen transitions were a bit smoother, but whatever. Because the horizontal transitions are... They're very good, because the horizontal transitions have this little bit of overlap. Where basically the camera still sees where you are, but it changes to the second camera. It's like a little area where both 
cameras if you imagine two cameras uh, one left camera one right camera and you go from the way left of the screen to the way right of the screen there's a little area in between where the cameras switch while you're still in full vision of them rather than the screen being split basically halfway the the camera's vision overlaps but the places where the camera switch don't overlap but that doesn't exist for him for cameras horizontally which really sucks horizontally you switch to a different camera the instant you get in its view range basically the range where you switch cameras and the range where your cameras can see you are the exact same I don't know if that makes any sense but whatever now let's go try and find that place with the iterators No, let go of me. Actually, let go of me. Don't you fucking dare. Go away. The grapple worms are extremely grabby, as you may have gleaned from their name. Yeah, let me just get. Nope. Fucker. Will not. Fuck around with me. I will kill you. And that's that. Did I kill it? I think I killed it. And I got its mask. I'm gonna jump over, try and eat it. No, get over here. Then jump over here. No, let go of the rocks, let go of that shit. Vulture mask, and off we go. I think this scavenger should be somewhat scared of me for a little while. Oh, there's there's a second motherfucker trying to harpoon me. Thankfully, I'm in an indoors area. King vultures may be powerful. But they cannot break the geometry, thankfully. Oh, I would like to kill this scab, though. I would very much like to kill this scab. Come on. Come on, come through. Yeah, there we, there we go. Well, I guess I can't kill that guy anymore. I'm trying to get a scavenger in here, so that I just throw the spear down. There we go. Just like that. Kill that guy too. Trying to steal spears from scavengers and then attacking them with those spears. I find that that's usually pretty effective to killing them. And also, this is the safest way to kill them I've found. Basically, force it, uh, force them to get out of a pipe 
before you which allows you to simply grab a spear and then once they're out of a pipe you just spear them These guys dead? No, they're not dead. That motherfucker just got stabbed and walked away. Well, that sucks. I hit the bomb instead of the scavenger, which stunned me. Thankfully, I think Artificer is immune to explosions. I think. So the explosions can do, the the most explosions can do is just stun him. Yeah, no, that's that's the biggest problem when you're fighting scavengers, like I just did, which is that bombs fuck your entire playstyle up unless they're far enough away that they don't stun you. And also, this guy absolutely loves to bounce off of things. You really shouldn't. Well, that guy has a spear and I don't, so I'm just gonna go. any spears I don't think he has spears I would very much like a spear from him he does not have a spear but that the drop wig has a bomb under it I could try to steal that that could be interesting oh scavengers coming in who actually have spears so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna dip for now Right, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good, they went away. And they're back. It's fine, they're no match for my parkour. The, uh, the thing with the scavengers is, I think they changed them so that now scavengers can attack, can uh, aim their attacks, I think. I don't... I don't think they could do that before, I might be wrong. Uh, but yeah, scavengers can now slightly aim where they attack. Meaning that you have to be really like far above them, at a pretty big angle, for, for them to not be able to just shoot you down. Which I guess that makes fighting scavengers a bit more interesting, but it also kind of just fucks you over. Because you can only aim left or right and down if you perform a backflip. But the scavengers, well, they can aim at like 45 degree angles, which you cannot do, as far as I'm aware. see the drop wing. Thankfully, I reacted in time. Actually, I'm gonna go eat the drop wing. How much do drop wings give even? I think it's only like two food. No, three food. That's, that's good. Three food is better than none food. I got a karma flower. I'm glad this guy can get karma flowers. Like, I'm aware I'm at the lowest karma and it does nothing, but 
A hunter couldn't even get karma flowers at all, so... I'm glad you can at least do that. Actually, I am going to go craft this spear. Use up one food. Because if I get this little guy, I get two food back. So now I'm full. Oh, scavengers. Will he come through? He came through. I don't have to use up this spear I just built on him. I really don't want to uselessly spend these spears. Does this just go up? Yeah, so where was the iterator? That was down, was it? So it was just way, 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 way up. You know, maybe it was over here. Yeah, it was over here. I'm just... I guess the map just didn't load. I hope that there's no scavengers here because I hate being sniped from off screen. That's just the worst. I might install that mod that like moves your camera. Twelfth Council Pillar. What did that say? Twelfth Council Pillar something house. I don't know. Whatever it is. We are now inside an iterator. And this iterator has a lot of spiders scavengers I'm guessing this place mostly has spiders and I really don't like rain world spiders they move so erratically I spiders in real life are not a big problem right I, I don't really care for them they they just kind of hang out in a corner make a web eat some annoying mosquitoes and stuff like that spiders in rain world are fucking terrifying and I don't want to I don't want to be near them I hate them If it's a single spider, I don't really care. The single spiders can't really do anything. Like, they can kind of pull you to the side a bit. And that's that's that. But when they culminate into one of those, like, coalescopedes or whatever they're called, they are so fucked. Alright, let's see. Game over, I guess. What killed me? I don't know. Something did. <laughs> I think that was one of those moments where a scavenger just snipes you from off screen. Those I really hate. Like, I really, really genuinely hate because there's no counterplay. You don't even know that a scavenger is there. Those are just, those are just straight up annoying. There's, because there's really no counterplay there. God damn it! I hate this one whole jump. There we go. And then through here. Hope that a scavenger doesn't just pop out. Right, it's fine. The scavengers are. They killed the drop wig. Right? Okay, they're not coming this way. Never mind. They are coming this way. I think one came through. No, it didn't. That was a that was a bad play. Will the scavenger walk through? Will he fuck me over? Yes. He went away. That's that's what I love to see. No. I don't care. More bad plans. They give me fuck all food. So they can go away. Simple as. 
this area should not be too hard. Here it's only hard if a bunch of scavengers spawn or you get like a king vulture or something like that. Otherwise it's pretty chill. Get the fuck. What the hell did... What the hell happened there? Who cares? Let's go see what that iterator has. And also let's read the name. You get out of the way, please. I would like to go through. I would very much like to just. I think those like green centipedes that fly, they are not generally aggressive towards you unless you attack them, at which point they become pretty aggressive. At least that's my experience with them. Will this drop wig fuck me over? No, it won't. That's nice. That's good. Good drop wig. Now. Any scavengers up here? No scavengers, surprisingly enough. Let's consume this little boy and let's eat this guy as well. There we go. Now I can craft few spears and still have still be ready for hibernation all right that guy's down let's hope this vulture doesn't fuck me over i zapped him so that's my zap spear gun but at least the vulture is gonna make a problem for the scavengers unless they kill it which they might scavengers to fuck me over here. No scavengers here either. House of Braids. Alright, interesting name. There's a fuck ton of scavengers right here. I don't like that. I really do not like that. They're gonna find their way into here somehow. Oh yeah, this is the place with this shit. Let's eat and run away. No. Go away. Here there's more spiders, because why wouldn't there be? Hopefully they don't form a coalescopy. That's fine. I got through. There's a few more spiders here. There's a scavenger, which... Hate, bye bye. I don't want to see you. Aha! Uh -huh. Another scavenger. Another piece of shit. And another one up there. Or down there. And a coalescopede formed, so I. I tried to hold on to that pole at the top, but apparently that's part of the background, not the foreground. Oh my god, is there... I'm, I need to check, is there a save spot in the metropolis? Is there a save spot around here that I have just not seen somehow? Over here, over here, the metropolis. The iterator in general doesn't seem like there is. There might be a safe space over here, but I don't know about that one. I'm gonna have to check that one out. Honestly, I. 
I would really like to move on to Gourmand now and not have to worry about scavengers, but whatever. Let's just get this mask. Because why not? Maybe it helps out, maybe it doesn't, I don't know. Get on our merry way. I don't even know what this is a mask of, because I've never seen like a... What are they called? A vulture with this type of mask. to fight scavengers like I want a nice place where I can stab the shit out of them this is a tough jump there we go Ooh, drop wig Do wish the scavengers did not suck to deal with this much. But they do. I can see why Pebbles wants me to kill all of them. Because they're annoying as hell. The drop is in a good spot this time. Let's go over here. Hope that no scavengers come through. That really is the worst thing that scavengers can do. Is just like spawn camp you, completely surround you. Because like, what what can you do? With? They just completely surround you from all sides. Okay, I'm gonna have to. I zapped that little centipede thing I did. Where the fuck? What is happening? What is happening? I think the centipede got me. I think the centipede got me and is gonna kill me. Nope, the scavenger killed me. Nice. I'm just gonna not have the mask. I think the mask brings bad luck. The past few runs where I've had a mask, they've all ended poorly. So I'm just gonna pretend it does not exist. Wait a little bit so that I don't overheat.
this guy really does rely entirely on your skills with killing scavengers and I'm not very good at it that's and the biggest downside of him is you have to be good at one very specific thing playing with awful like absolutely dreadful scavenger reputation consume this guy and off we go damn that was a really long worm over. Another big centipede. I don't think it's gonna fuck with me. It's not gonna fuck with me. That's, that's good. That's very good. That's lovely, in fact. Oh, don't try to go into that pipe. Go around. I, I really just want to find a safe spot around here somewhere that's that's really like the one and only thing i really need right now is a safe spot that's closer to the iterator oh really you're gonna be that kind of a dick oh 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 really can i grab it through the floor No, no I can't, sadly. Oh, I can't even go through there. Oh, fuck you. Fuck you. No. Drop this. Drop this motherfucker, I said. Why did you throw the spear? Why are you back here? Alright, you attack him, sure. I'm gonna take the bomb. Where did you... He took my bomb. He took the bomb. Straight up took the bomb. The piece of shit drop weight. Honestly, I think the only reason I'm having this much trouble on Artificer is because in literally every single playthrough of Rain World, I have always had positive reputation with scavengers. Even on Hunter, I I gave the scavengers multiple pearls. Uh, to repair my relations with them. I've never had this much negative rep with the scavengers. Absolutely never had this much. Can I eat this guy? No, I, I, don't, I can't. I can't throw him away though. He's not really needed for anything. Now I just run away. Here's the thing with spears in this game, they they get thrown much they travel much faster than you would think. And they have much more of a straight arc than you would think. Oftentimes, I have had problems with scavengers because I just underestimate how fucking straight these, how fast and how straight these spears go. Like, every single time. They're like bullets, basically. Having a spear is basically having a gun with one bullet. Alright, this thing, I don't think it's evil. I don't think it wants, yeah, no, it doesn't want to kill me. I think it would only try to kill you if you try to attack it, which is what I witnessed last time I played. Is there a scavenger on this pole? There is no scavenger on this pole. You can see there's like five fucking scavengers down here pointing at me. They, they really want me dead. That's that's the thing with these scavengers. They they absolutely want me dead, and I can't really go past them because of how many there are. You can see, 
how fucking far up they threw those spears. That guy floated way up. I think they were attacking that big thing that I said was not hostile until you attack it. Hopefully they have. Meaning that that thing would be hostile to the scavengers and not to me. Hopefully. I think... I... I think that's how it works. If they even attacked it. Oh yeah, spear got thrown back at them. Yep, that is... That is one of those... Like, I'm just gonna call them, like... Defense systems. Yeah, I'm just gonna call it a defense system. I think that, like, blue... Defense system that was right here. Nope, never mind. That's not the thing that was attacking them. This thing is now walking downwards. I stand right here. Is it gonna attack me? No. It doesn't care for it. That's good. That's good. That's lovely. I like this thing. This thing is good. This thing is very, very good. As you can see, it does not, it does not attack me. Even though it's all red and evil right now, it does not give two shits about me. That is excellent. That is absolutely excellent. If this thing can kill the scavengers for me, that would just be amazing. That would be the greatest thing. Kill that scav. Give me this. And go away. No, 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 no. Die. There we go. Whoa. I want to try and grab a spear. I really want to try and grab a spear. An explosive spear would be... A spear or an explosive or the best possible thing, an explosive spear. Explosives will instantly stun you. Explosive spears are great because... Well, uh, for a few reasons. Number one, when they blow up, they're gone. Like, they're just straight up, like, blew up. It's not there anymore. So scavengers can use them against you. Number two, because you shoot it and it explodes, a little later you have time to hear the sizzling of it and then run away before it kills you. And lastly, it does a fuck ton of damage, so why wouldn't you use it? Now I just hope I don't run in to that scavenger again. Nice. Right. Amazing. That scavenger was on top. Now it's... Alright. There's a whole bunch of... Uh... Come on. Go away. Go away, motherfucker. Die. That's even better. You should die. I really would like to... Sp Steal some guy's spear. You know, that was just a rock. Alright, they're away for a little bit. So I am gonna go get a spear. I'm gonna craft it. Can I craft it from a pipe? I don't think I can craft it from a pipe. Can I, though? I can. Because if I do kill a scavenger... I get food from its body. Meaning that it's a straight positive trade if I kill a scavenger with an explosive spear. Because you get like four or five food. I think it was like four food from a scavenger corpse. And I only need one piece of peep of not peep. I only need one pip of food. Whoa. Alright. I'm up. I'm up. They can't do anything against me now. I am safe. Probably. So that's where I died last time. In the air. 
because the scavengers just have mad fucking skill shots. Okay. I see. I go in here real quick. Alright. I don't think there are scavengers here. There are lamps here, meaning that there are probably scavengers here, but let's explore the area a little bit. Alright, this looks interesting. A little bit terrifying, but you know. What's over here? The floor. Okay, the floor, I guess. Oh, why, why? God fucking damn it. No, the, the poison's gonna come through soon. Yep, there it is. Oop. Sorry, I hit my mic there. Something attacked it. Was that a scavenger? Are there more scavengers here? How long? Oh, I think it's night time. I think that's the problem. Oh, yeah. Now there's... Over here, there's no rain. Instead, there's... There's a day-night cycle. That's gonna be night. I'm guessing. It's kind of like Minecraft, and you really don't want to be around. Can I eat this thing? I can eat that thing. Good. I'm guessing this is like Minecraft, and you really don't want to be around during the night without a shelter. Oh, good shot, good shot. Good shot there, Scavrendo. That did not hit where I wanted, but it's fine. Is there shelter anywhere around here? I really don't want to go up there where the blue lizard is. Is there anywhere I can go up? There's no way I can go up. I don't want to go where the blue lizard is, but I think the way left is very dangerous and I don't want to gamble. I really do not want to gamble, but fuck it down here. There's another spider. Ooh, that scavenger scared the shit out of me. Why can those guys carry so much? I still have not found a shelter. Is there a secret room here? There's a secret room here. I'm guessing that's just a traitor outpost or something like that. Right, that spider should be dead. There we go. That's dead. Oh, of course. Why wouldn't there be a scavenger tome? Why wouldn't there be? Oh, oh so many scavengers. Oh no. Oh, this is horrible. Oh, this is terrible. This really sucks. Okay, they didn't get me. <laughs> they did not get me. That's the important thing. That I have survived. And will continue to do so. There's no place for me to go here. Plus a scout can snipe me. Yeah, no, I think those scabs are on the hunt. I think they're on the hunt for slug cats. Okay. That's that's a lot of orange lizards. I do not care for dealing with all of you. Alright, thank you. Thank you. Safari region unlocked. Very cool. That's just a squid cada.
I like the lack of rain that one squid gators go through. We'll just push them out of the way, it doesn't really matter. Of the water. If past regions have taught me anything, it's that you really do not want to deal with water. Also, this music is nice. Yes, shelter. Do I have food? I have food. Yes, yes. Fuck, get through, get up, go up, go up. Why can't I go up? Let me get up. No, alright. I'm gonna have to go around the side. Don't you dare attack me now. I'm going to this shelter right fucking here. Oh, this is a nice big shelter. Oh, man. Oh, yes. 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 Okay. Okay, this is good. This is good. This is really good. I killed a bunch of shit. find a bunch of echoes though so that I can get higher karma then I think after I have a good amount of echoes I think like at least maybe you need all of them but yeah after I get some echoes I'm gonna try and find my way to moon because maybe moon can help me get my karma back up to normal no grab that thing because if you've seen my past playthrough pebbles was not very helpful he basically gave me the key to enter this region and said fucking murder scavengers and then basically gave up uh, he gave me literally no car So I am going to try to find some way to increase my karma and ascend because yes I'm happy to fulfill Pebbles', Pebbles request for now but I would very much like to not stay here and just kill scavengers for a hundred cycles. go the Miros birds have moved away so oh this is in the pipe uh, I think this guy is showing me news reports at this point I'm sorry but I can't read those Apparently, there's some way to go up there. I don't know what it is. What's through here? Let's see. It's spiders. It is... It's a coalescapede. You love to see a coalescapede. They're just the best things to deal with. They really hate light, though. Like, they really hate light. Oh, they've deformed. They've stopped being a coalescapede. 12th Council Pillar, the House of Braids. Nice. Why are you showing me advertisements? Pebbles, I do not care for the advertisements of your people. I thought, even though society has... I thought that... With the, with the total collapse of decent society, there would be no more advertising, but apparently I was wrong. And also, apparently, Muros birds go this way. Did I turn on vanilla exploits? I don't know if I turned on vanilla exploits. Doesn't really matter. 
I would very much like to car my cash, but I don't need to right now, so I'm just not even gonna bother checking. So, I am right now, apparently, on the floor. Meaning that, likely, there's not much stuff below me. And conversely, there's a lot of stuff above me. I would very much like to go up. Or at least to find some interesting stuff down here. Because right now it's all it's all mirrors birds. Apparently Apparently you can't go through that spot. I don't know what I can and can't go through. Actually, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna real quick exit, check if I do have vanilla exploits turned on for the more slack cats expansion that's not over here it should be here yeah it's here is it here the sable shelter failures prevents chance of waking up early before the rain has stopped i didn't know that was a thing disable pre-cycle flooding prevents the chance of the region being flooded during a shelter failure scenario don't i've never had a shelter fa fail scenario so that's fine Scav corpses, I'm not gonna adjust that. Lost the scavenger corpses, I'm not gonna adjust that. Artificer explosion capacity. Maximum number of su subsequent explosion actions artificer can perform before dying. So what you're saying is if I blow up too much, I die. Alright, I didn't know that. More slug cat cheats, I'm not gonna touch those. Let me check out the... Ex no, it's not... It's not the expansion. We'll go back. It's the Rain World Remix. General. Vanilla exploits. Yeah, that's good. I like that. Vanilla exploits are turned on, so I can Karma Cash if needed. I guess let's just go right. Maybe this is the way to moon because if you remember from like the second or third episode or whatever it was, apparently there was no way to look to the moon. And now I think this might be a way to get to moon. The scavenger have to be right here. Can you move away? Yeah, come through here. That's fine. And this, this other guy as well. Can I? Can you try to come through here so I can stab you? Hello. He is completely oblivious. This guy to go through and hopefully there we go hopefully now I can go unimpeded can I get up there I'd like to get up there you can get up here is there anything up here no no you can just kind of huddle into a corner there but not much otherwise. Right, but at least I know I can just jump away if the birds happen to be running by. Is the cycle just gone already? Right, this guy seems to be showing me like an ancient I think you're showing me some form of some type of person, I don't know. I probably should have played Gourmand first to understand this, but I don't care. 
now I'm going to run away. So that these scavengers can't shoot me. Never mind. Let's go under here. I don't want to be caught out by the birds again. Oh, I can hear them run by. Can I go through here? I can go through here. I cannot go through here. Maybe I can. I don't know. I'm somewhere. Can I see where I am? Aha. Alright. Can I go up now? Nope. I have to go. So I have to go up. Left, up. There we go. Hope the birds don't kill me. Go through here. Here's a bunch of spiders. Nope. That's a coalescopede. Go kill the scavenger instead of me. That's good. That's good coalescopede behavior. Do not kill me. I humbly request of you to stay alive. those birds just off themselves that's amazing I would love if it happened more please I cannot go through here oh my god I have to go the dangerous way of course they wouldn't put a platform up there they... of course the devs would do this of course they would do this why and those scavengers are behind me they're probably gonna kill me right right through pretend it's no problem hello let's go through here the birds doing their thing they're eating scavengers so it's fine <coughs> go away thank you Please, no more birds, unless they have scavengers in their mouths, in which case that's fine. If a bird is eating a scavenger, I'm cool with it. Do I, do I try to climb up there? Do I, do I really feel like it? Do I feel like wasting time? I feel like wasting time, let's go. There we go, there we go, there we go. Now what's up here? Up here seems to be a bunch of bullshit. Let's explore this bunch of bullshit. I hope this is not like a filtration system type area. I really hope it's not a filtration system. Please don't tell me this is filtration system to electric boogaloo. really don't feel like doing that right now. I want to see what's through here, but I really just don't not want to mess around with a second filtration system. Oh no, it's completely dark. I'm confused about the cycle timer at this point. I'm also fucking terrified of those scavengers up there. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna... go away slowly. Can I see them on the minimap? I can see them on the minimap. That's cool. It's not really a minimap, but I can see them. Oh. Oh, no. No, go away. Go away. Let me go through. Yeah, run away. Run away like the cowards you are. I really don't want to surround myself by scavenger corpses from all sides in this side of an area because you really can't go around them. 
but fine if I have to. They do kind of surround me. They do kind of do that, though. Can I drag this guy out of the way? No. I want to grab the guy. No. Come down here. Get. Get here. No. No, go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Die. Get the fuck. Oh my god. Maneuvering through this area is so fucked. Go away. Alright. There we go. Let's grab the shock spear because the shock spear, I think, works the best. It's still night time. I do not know how this cycle timer works. Let's see what's up here. Cannot be good, that's for sure. Right, I guess I need a spear. Give me one of these boring spears so that I can stab it into the wall. There we go. And that should be good enough. Go up here. Nope. Don't hit your head on the ceiling. That's not advised. Up here seems to be more garbage. I don't like this. I really don't like this. I feel like I'm gonna get myself killed. Alright, we got up and down. And I have a feeling. Up is gonna be more dangerous now that it's nighttime than down. So I'm gonna go up to investigate. There's a lizard. Thankfully, it was turned away from me. Oh my god, I'm gonna drop into a bottomless pit and die. Let's go. Thankfully, there's reduced gravity. Is this a bottomless pit? I don't know. And I don't want to find out. If it's not a bottomless pit, then this is probably some like important lore area. I don't know if this like this area is supposed to like go down or go up. I drop my spear like a fool. If the area is supposed to go down then this kind of sucks. I'm in a standoff with a scavenger. Thankfully, by just moving out of his line of sight, I escaped it. So up here, it's just... It's Shaded Citadel 2, I guess. Electric Boogaloo. So let's not fuck around with Citadel 2. Let's get my spear back. Let's go down. I really don't like these screen transitions there. These downward screen transitions when having to deal with scavengers, they suck. Alright, let's zap that guy. Go back down. Is he gonna recover from this? I stabbed him again. Drop this here, and I'm gonna try to get that scav corpse and throw him down there. That I never have to deal with him again. Put 
the spears down, put the rocks down. Go away, rock. No, I don't want the spear. I don't want the mask. I want to just grab this scavenger corpse and throw it away. Because it's blocking my way. Do I have food? I don't have food. I should have eaten it. I'm so dumb. I'm so bad at this game. No, go turn around. Yeah, there we go. I don't need the glow rocks. I ate an Oran. So it's fine. All right, now, where was I going? <laughs> right, let's go back, over, and then more right. I went down, yeah, down, more down, more down. Just go here, and then go more down. And uh, yeah, here you just kind of go down, and then you go some down some more, and then you go a bit more down. And then you encounter all the scavenger corpses. Oh my god. I need to bring them over. Come here. Go away. I get this guy. I need to get the spears out of the way first. Come here. Three scavengers dead right here. Oh, actually, that's good. I'm gonna just... There we go. No, I... I wanna go up. Throw this guy down. And there we go. Now... this down as well so many spears so so many spears eat this guy as well throw him away never mind I guess I have to carry him thankfully I think artificer can carry scavengers much easier than other slug cats because otherwise this would be just genuine hell also i guess i can carry him for the karma in case there happens to be a karma gate around here i don't think there will be but there might just be plus if a lizard happens to be going through i guess i can feed the lizard There's some upsides, I guess, to carrying a scav corpse. I want this. Arena character unlock. Alright, that's that's an unlock for Artificer. That's nice. I can't go there. You're actually telling me I was supposed to go up the entire time. No. Up. No, not to the side. Jump up. Not to the side. Jump up and left. There we go. So yeah, there's just nothing over there. That's... Thank you, game. At least this is better than that time I had to carry scavengers through acid garbage wastes really sucked but alright let's go let's do let's finish this cycle should be going fine and dandy from now on Things generally don't really go around at night, it seems. Oh, 
Oh. I would like to throw you away. Yeah. I'd like an explosive spear. There we go. Alright, I'm gonna go try and find shelter. Actually, let's see what's over to the side here, because I did not explore this area. What's up here? Or rather, what's to the left of here? We have... more tunnels. Interesting. Is there anything in these tunnels? There's more tunnels. No black lizards, no mole lizards here. Are there? No. No mole lizards. Alright. Let's see what's over this way. Alright, this is just a way back there. Alright. I know where to go now. I wish I was a bit faster in these, but I'm not, so. Eh, whatever. Probably don't want to go through there. I'll go down here. Then down here if I get yet. Alright. Now I go up and right, and then we go that way where the scavengers came from, with the big pit. I'm glad there's some life left, at least at night. These worms. This is nice. I like I like peaceful rain world. This is nice. It is a bit tense because I don't know where that lizard went. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna grab this mask just just in case I see a lizard. Hopefully this kind of this fucking rock. This fucking rock. That fucking rock blocks an entire slug cat from going through. Come on, man. I think I scared it. I did. Alright. Can you move away? Can you not camp this place? Come on. Hey, look at me. I have a mask. Is it not scared of the mask anymore? It's not scared of the mask anymore. Yep, I... Come on down. Hey, that's that works. Now I go up. This thing is kind of it's it, I mean it's faster than me, but it's kind of dumb when it comes to moving through this place. I'm just back here. Just back here. Are the scavengers still here? I don't think they are. What places here did I not explore? I want to know. Uh, let's see. Load the map. Come on, load the map. I didn't go right. I also didn't go here, so I should have gone down. Yeah. Right there. So now I'm here. Now you can just keep going right and then up and then more right. So let's let's try and do that. Let's see what's over this way. There are scavengers still. Of course. Of course. Of course. Lovely. 
Lovely, lovely, lovely. I didn't... No, I didn't want to check out what was happening around here. Also, I can't really see the difference between like day and night. Everything seems to be basically the same. Like, are there differences? Do, like, more hostile things spawn during the night? The scavenger, could you, could you go away? Could you go away, please? Yes. Thank you. Thank you very much. Got it. I did not get it. Yep. I should have guessed. Is that terrain flat? Is that terrain like flat? I can't see through the immense amount of decoration there. Is that? Yeah, it is. It's a single block incline. Alright, I'm gonna stop the stream for now and I'm gonna continue tomorrow probably. So, yeah. See you guys next time. This this has been a pretty like pretty productive day when it comes to Artificer, I think at least. Even though I did die a lot. Uh that's kinda just how Artificer plays. But yeah. See you guys next time. Have a good one. Bye bye.